Good morning, ma'am. I am Yamba Wiley Joyce, your medical technologist for today. May I confirm your name? Catherine Stapleton. Your age? 20 years old. And your birthday? June 23, 2002. Do you have any ID po ba for verification? Yes. Okay, thank you po. So, ask po lang po if are you taking medicine po ba for the past two weeks? No. Okay, ma'am, that's good. So, according to your acquisition form, I'm going to perform capillary puncture. So, I will go into puncture either your third or fourth finger. So, this procedure po is called bleeding time and clotting time. So, let's start, ma'am. <laughs> What is bleeding time? Bleeding time is a medical test that measures how fast small blood vessels in the skin stops bleeding. The bleeding time test is used to evaluate how well a person's blood is clotting. The test evaluates how long it takes the vessels cut to constrict and how long it takes for platelets in the blood to seal off the hole. These are the materials that we need for the bleeding time. So the first thing that we need to do before we start is to gather all the materials that we will be needing for the procedures. After gathering all the materials that we will be needing for the procedure, do on hand hygiene and put on gloves for protection. May I see your fingers, ma'am? Choose an appropriate finger for the procedure. Disinfect the area for skin puncture using a 70% alcohol and in a circular motion. Puncture the area to a depth of 3 mm. Start the timer immediately as soon as the first drop of blood appears. Blood the flowing blood with a filter paper every 30 seconds. Do not let the filter paper touch the skin and do not press the puncture area. Use a new area of the filter paper for every blood so that you can monitor the disappearance of blood. Stop the timer as soon as the flow of blood disappears. Count the number of bloods and divide it by 2 to get the bleeding time result in minutes. Dispose properly all the materials that we use. So what is clotting time? Clotting time is the time required for a sample of blood to coagulate into vitro under a standard conditions. These are the materials that we need for the clotting time.
So, the second procedure po is the clotting time. May I see your finger? Select an appropriate finger for the skin puncture. Massage the chosen finger and this helps to increase the flow of blood. Clean the selected area using a 70% alcohol wipes in a circular motion and let it air dry. Puncture the selected site in a depth of 3 mm. Wipe the first drop of blood. Place the second drop of blood onto the glass slide and start the timer immediately. Pass the tip of the lancet through the drop of blood every 30 seconds and check for the formation of fibrin strand. Stop the timer when fibrin strands are seen attached to the tip of the lancet. This is what the fibrin strands looks like. So the fibrin strand starts at 2 minutes and 30 seconds. Dispose all the materials that we use in a sharp container and in a biohazard bag. And perform an hand hygiene.